Ethan? What's up, man? <laughs> I love that joke. Melman and Roy brought you this. Alright. Good afternoon, Mr. Hunt. This is your mission should you choose to accept it. The story of Moses and your mission has only just begun. Your job is now to figure out what happened after Moses was born and for dramatic purposes retell the story so that everyone may learn the truth. Should you or any of your associates be called or questioned, we disavow any knowledge of your actions. This message will self-destruct in five seconds. What? Not again? Ugh. What do you mean again? Just trust me on this. At some point. Whoa! That's what I'm talking about, not again. Ugh. What's going on here? Ain't nobody got time to explain all that. We have another Mission Impossible. To the Googles. Our Google search led us to the Bible, which in turn leads us to Exodus and the wilderness, where our story continues. The angel of God appeared to Moses in flames of fire within a bush. Moses saw that even though the bush was on fire, it was not burned up, and he walked closer to it. Moses! Moses! Here I am, God! Who am I? Why have you chosen me to go to Pharaoh? In Egypt? I'm a murderer! A nobody! I will be with you. This will be a sign. It will bring my people to worship me at this very mountain. Suppose I do go back to Egypt and say to the Hebrews, the God of your father has sent me. And they ask me, what is his name? What shall then I answer them, Lord? I am who I am. Another stunning story about Moses. And we got all the information because you are the man. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to come back tomorrow night with two friends. <laughs>